please tag the Nigerian police. Tag them. Tag the Nigerian police. Tag tag the tag all the Nigerian police. Tag all of them. Tag yourself. They want to be the one to always bring out the case. So we gave them chance to work. Now this case was not given to us by the Nigerian police. We gave them this job. We brought their attention to this job. Is Samilari bigger than the Nigerian police? Is Samilari bigger? Why why are they treating him like they're treating him like like he's bigger than the Nigerian police? So the question Nigerians want to know is the fact that you brought out a letter petition and Benjamin, you put it out there for us to read. You understand? It would be better for you also to do a video of recording a, a similarity. Let the whole world see because this case is no longer Nigerian police case. This is a world case. This is a case be between the diasporas and the Nigerians. Similarity bigger than the Nigerian police. I want to know. We have a lot of videos out there. Now, first and foremost, is APC trying to protect Samilari? Because, fine, I believe that once there's a transaction between someone and that transaction is gone, this is a new transaction, is APC trying to protect Samilari? Because APC used Samilari during the election. Samilari was one of the boys that were used to intimidate the Igbos and the obedience. Samilari was, the video is out there on the internet. So it will be very, very cool because we have been cool. Nigerian police, there is somebody in Ikoi that was given a petition by this young boy. Now you're putting it out there like you're doing your job. Let me ask, let me ask you a question, Nigerian police. Is that the way to ask a question? Okay, let him provide to us the, the account to send the two million naira to. Paste, show us how did he pay him their money because I believe at that point in time, he was still under Naramali. So if, if, if he was to do a business with, with uh, Mobad, according to what he has written, then it means that it, means that it was Naramali that he was supposed to be chasing. So can you see that the story does not correlate and you put it out there, which is, is even telling you guys that case closed. Uh -uh. Are you guys trying to tell me that Samilari is now bigger than your system? Who are you serving Nigerian police? Are you not a public servant? Don't you read your constitution? Who are you supposed to be protecting? Who? Are you not supposed to be protecting the citizen? Oh, now. Okay. So, Nigerians, let me tell you what is happening in Nigerian police. You see, every powerful person in Nigerian police was sponsored by either one politician or the other. They are placed in there so that they will know which case is coming in and which case is coming out. Just like they wanted to give uh, Naramali the NDLA ambassadorship. It would have been a, a camouflage flag. They would have used that to, to, to do their business, just like Pablo Escobar trying to become the president of, of Colombia. The same templates, similar idea. So, we gave Nigerian police this case. And fine, you guys have been doing a good job because you guys helped us. You helped us to take up the body. Fine, the body is in the mortuary. Now, he's told us to give you two weeks. And we're doing two weeks. Now, you, you, the same people, now went to pick Samilari. You know, update us, show us his picture. But when, when, uh, Shonkuti slapped a Nigerian police, what did you all do? We all even supported you, Nigerian police. Didn't you all went to Sam, uh, Shonkuti's house to ask him? So this is an assault. The evidence is there. This guy is a bully. Fine, he has worked for the APC. He has worked for, for the, for, he has done so many dirty works. Okay, fine. So now, are you trying to tell us that this similarity is bigger than your system? It's time for you to put your house in order. Because Nigeria is about to be 63 years old and he has never worked. There has never been justice for the common man. Now, the whole world will know. Your name shall be written because we will post all your names. So the, the, the name of the DPO, the name of the committee, the person that was in charge that, that, that Mobad sent that stuff to, we will post, post your name on the social media. Don't worry. You think you guys are smarter? This is not... See, in the next five years, you see all those channels, television, all those people on NTA, there will be of no use because everybody will be on the internet because they've been controlled by these politicians. If I'm you, if you're watching this video, it's time to, to disconnect yourself from all those TV stations because they are of no use. All those journalists, they are of no use. They've been bought. So, by cut them. Stop viewing them. They don't have any... They, they're, not, they're not helping to solve issues. Instead, they are protecting the, the, the people that have been oppressing the common man. 
We are creating a website. No matter how they try to bring that website down, we did it last year. They tried try to bring it down. They can't bring it down this time around. Because it doesn't make sense why you are treating this man like he's like a president. You are treating Samilari like he's the president. You are treating him like a king. What are you hiding? So, Olu, are you protecting this man because he works for you during the APC election? We want Nigerians to know. We want Nigerians to know. I'm going to off this comment session so that I can speak my mind. I don't want to be distracted. For how long? For how long would there be not be justice in this country? This case is simple. Go to the immigration. Check out their, their, their in and out log. Check their passports. When did they travel out? It's in a system there. It's on the immigration there. It's very simple. So somebody came and tell you that he has not been in the country, whereas there's evidence. Look, let me show you guys evidence. Look, look, read. Ogun, why you? Liar, you have been out since August 20th, but you still scattered my event August 26th at Wave Beach in Legoshi with your boys because the DJ was playing Shay Vibe songs in Zeno's presence. You claim you paid 2 million to Mobad directly. You can't pay any Malian record artist directly to perform at any show. The money either goes to Naramali account show you guys or Malian one. Records account. Enter you can see for yourself. This is the reason why they have always been jungle justice in Nigeria. Because the police, who is supposed to be protecting the citizen, always protect their master. So who is to protect the common man? That was why the court was created. The court was created to protect themselves from the likes of the hooligans. How did we get here? Since 1960, the hooligans started their own movement with the power they got into. They, even, they started this oppression. None of them are innocent. They created someone like Tinubu because Tinubu himself when he became the governor of Lagos State, he had no money. So he had to create his own system. And that's why he's the most powerful man right now. And that's why he was able to help Buhari become a president. For tailors of power. Positioning. It's like a chess game. You need to think like a mafia. Tinubu understood this game. What did he do? He empowered people. He sponsored people. If you are a policeman, Tinubu will sponsor you to make sure you become a very, very powerful man. He positioned his own people. Look at the Oba of Lagos. Is that an Oba? That one is a puppet that is being used for political issues to use threats because fear is what the men use to intimidate the poor. The reason why the rich are rich is because of fear. The moment you can take fear out of the equation, then you can win. Like me. For me to get involved in this case, I'd rather fight for it till the end. I'm not running. I'm not a coward. I'm not going to be scared. I see a lot of comments. I know, I know people in, upper, in higher places. I have people in APC. Yeah, I have friends in there, but I don't care anymore about this time because this is a stain to the brand of APC government. If you are doing something, do it with wisdom. This guy will stain your whites. Sorolu, this guy will stain your whites. Tinumbu, this guy will stain your whites. APC, this guy will stain your white. Do the needful. If this is going to be the renew hope that he promised Nigeria for, if this is going to be the bad day for Nigeria independence, on, or that's going to be on Sunday, then do the needful. Whether the autopsy comes out or not, there's evidence of assault in America. That's a case. For the fact that there's already deception, deception already is a crime. When you're trying to mislead the police, you're giving them different direction. That is deception. So is it that most of you don't even know your job as a police? Ben Ayedin. You just come and you just tweet because you know how to tweet. You are a public servant. You are meant to serve the people. Do the needful. And stop intimidating. And all you police telling bloggers not to post because you are doing your job. Who is stopping you for doing your job? Who is stopping you for doing your job? Didn't Mobad wrote a petition in the first place? Who canceled the petition? An higher power because this Samilari guy has connection. In Nigeria, if you don't have connection, you are you are an empty man. Without connection, you are nothing. Connection, you have to have connection in higher places. If you don't have connection, you are nothing. So I'm going to tell the Nigerian police because I believe that this work is just getting started. Now I understand. Now I now understand why they have to do Renomokri two days ago. They did not sneak in Samlai because Samlai was already running. You think we don't? We were not tracking him. Boy, is a tracker now. From Kenya, he was trying to go to Moza, uh, Mombasa. Mombasa. <laughs> so he was running because where he won't go? 
Your face on the car. So he was running. He had nowhere to run to. So fine. He called out, okay, he's ready to, 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 to work with the police, to assist the police. Oshie, assistant class captain. And Nigerian police. Esheo, Esheo. With evidence everywhere on social media. Look at yesterday in America. There's a lady that they just arrested in America yesterday. What did she do? She was recording when they were, they were, they were stealing the goods. She's an accomplice. That's how the law is being done. So which law are you guys practicing? Share more when you kill and car. Echo, share more to air more share money. She can't go down Nigeria and look at you too late. Because at the end of the day, all of us have rights in this country. Nobody's bigger than anybody in this country. Nigeria belongs to all of us. Uh uh. I mean, what did they happen? The, the common man does not have justice. Our politician man, they will steal billions. They will get away with it. But the common man will steal soap. They will, they, the, the, the streets will do jungle. The policeman will quickly take, look at portable the other day. They quickly arrange courts. Also, the Belosi courts. Because he's a common man. But the big man, Emagbo, because you are a slave to them. Slave. Police, are you a slave? Don't you know that you have you are supposed to be protecting the citizens? What is the meaning of police in the first place? What is the meaning of police? What are you policing? Are you not supposed to be securing the lives of the citizens and their goods, protecting them from internal threats, external threats, and internal vulnerability? So, what is your job and what is your role as a police for the Nigerian citizens? On Sunday, we'll tell them I want to do Nigeria Independence Day. There's nothing independent about Nigeria because we're still under the same slave mentality of hierarchy, of men of higher power. All they need to do is to do full call. So this message, APC, I'm a drag you, do the needful. Fix this problem. Let's solve it and move on. Power is temporary. Where is Buhari today? Is Buhari still in power? He has gone temporary. So whatever you're doing, understand this fact that none of you have, none of you is bigger than anybody in Nigeria. We're all equal. If Nigeria belongs to all of us, then prove it to us. Enough of bullying the citizens during the election. Nigeria were bullied. You divided the country with tribalism, with the Oba. The Oba is a slave of Lagos. I say it. See, if the Oba is Lagos, what you're telling, I said, is a slave with a puppet. The Oba of Lagos is a pop to Tinubu. It's temporary. What's going to happen to me? Oh, Sam Clair, be careful. They will We're all going to die once. You're afraid of death? Nobody's living this world alive. Kill him, kill him, kill him, bear with What are we afraid of that we can't speak out? I do not belong to anybody. I belong to God myself. What is it I've not lost that I can't speak about? Enough is enough. For, for, for how long? For how long shall you keep oppressing the common man? If you are watching this, off your television. Stop watching all those news, all those channels, C uh, all those television, TVC. They belong to your politician. They are changing the narrative. Off your television. Change your channels. Let in America, nobody watch television anymore. Everybody's on the internet. We will give you the fact news. If we don't stop the likes of Naramali and Samilari, then I don't know the day I can categorically tell you that Nigeria is a jungle. And in a jungle where the kings refuse to do the needful, there might be jungle justice. And that is why they've been juggling justice in Nigeria. 63 years of oppression, 63 years of suffering. What is it I want to tell you guys that Fela have not so told you guys? Fela sang in a song. Fela was a prophet. Fela told you guys, he sang about everything. He warned you guys. But you guys rather allow yourself to be used and be manipulated. Because manipulation can be used positively or negatively. Many of you go to church and you read your Bible upside down. The 
you allow your men of God to brainwash you? How many of them have come out to speak against injustice because they are benefiting from this suffering? Many of you, we've been trying to tell you the truth, but you said we are mad. But well, how many of them have the courage, like Elisha on Elijah, who called out Queen Jezebel? How many of them? How many of them? This young man is a combination. It was so planned that you cannot even have trace. But with the video we have, I think that enough should be able to use at least there should be a jail time of them.